today we're gonna be reviewing the Link GPS tracking device. This was sent to us from the company and they give us one year subscription for Venus and Apollo to be testing it and review it. Even though they send us for free, all the opinions will be 100% honest and the things that are good will be good and the things that are bad, we will say they are bad. So don't worry about it. Though I want to mention right from the beginning that this was sent to us for free. Today is actually Christmas Eve and right after I film this, we are going for Christmas Eve dinner. So this is the perfect moment to start testing something like this. Especially the, here in Florida, a lot of people use fireworks and dogs tend to get scared and you don't want them to run away, but a lot of dogs run away during the time of Christmas, 4th of July, New Year's and all those types of holidays when there's fireworks, loud music and a lot of parties going on. So this came in the best moment possible because we are around the corner New Year's next week and we are today is the day before Christmas so it's a nice Christmas present for them and a really nice thing to have right before the holidays. Let's open it and see what is inside and what is all about the Link GPS tracking device. So let's see what is inside. Link the smart bed wearable. We have a bag with what it looks like some accessories and then we have two boxes with the name of Venus and Apollo. what it looks like a bandana this bandana is way too small for Venus and Apollo but I think for most dogs it could fit them but there's no way it will ever fit Venus and Apollo let's see what is inside hi my name is Link I imagine this is the pamphlet with all the information and the instructions. What is inside the box? It looks like we have two attachments and a charger. There's a QR code. Here we have our wearable. I will say it's like around 2 inches by 1 inch. I will measure it later on to give you the exact measurement. It's made out of plastic. Here we have two attachments. Our third attachment is the elastic one. This one is for colors. And our second attachment is like a clip. This one also could work with some colors and I imagine with most hardnesses as well. It's also made out of plastic like the color. The three attachments are made of the same material. And of course here we have our charger. Is a standard USB charger. And the little cable that goes from a USB to a USB mini, I think. Here we have the attachments that came in the little bag outside. I'm not sure if this one will come if you get it yourself. If this one is an extra attachment that they send us. Because it didn't come inside the box. So I will have to ask and I will put a note. This one is with Velcro and that one I think is perfect to fit most places. Let's use the QR code to download the app. And of course I have Apple so we will go to the App Store of Apple. Let's 
here is the app is a beautiful teal color the login like all tracking devices you have to allow them to track your device so we have to allow them and it links with bluetooth because this was sent to us they have already give us a login with our email and a password that they choose for us that we will change in the future pet provide you with insightful activity monitoring to help you be more in a foreign pet parent Answer to question to help customers Apollo's activity recommendation. Normal walk, at what point is Apollo ready to stop and rest? Almost immediately, after a leisurely stroll in Sniff, Beat, and did his business and greeted all the neighborhood. Uh, what are you talking about? Apollo could walk all day. For Apollo, this is the option that we will choose. What are you talking about? Apollo could walk all day. Let's say you and Apollo are in the park on a weekend morning running and playing with no time restriction. How long before Apollo is tired? In less than time that it takes to drink my cup of coffee. After about 15 minutes, I wish Apollo will get tired. I feel bad calling it quits when it's time to leave. These are the recommendations they give us, like daily activities, 72 minutes, Apollo, his breed is Alaskan Malamute. Here he say that he's one year old, 11 pounds, male, which obviously is wrong. So we are going to try to change that now. He's five years old and his weight is 96 pounds. And it's really cute that he have the AKC ID. This company used to be owned by the AKC and Apollo is AKC, so later on we will pull his AKC number. Let's choose his profile picture. Recently we did Christmas pictures, so I will be using one of them. Not sure what I did wrong, but when I upload the picture, it went back to 11 pounds and one year old, so I have to redo that. This is my first time strolling through the app, so let's see. Here is the activity level, how many minutes, adventure, steps, miles, what time of the day. On top, you have the tracking. Link tracks your dog location anywhere in the US with advanced cellular GPS connectivity. GPS location tracking, your link collar uses advanced GPS technology, just like your smartphone. GPS connection require a direct line of sight to satellite in the sky and will not work indoors under tunnels in thick wooden areas. Location accuracy, it depends on a combination of cellular connectivity and GPS signal. Link places, there are two main types of safe zone your link. It talk about the location status, tips and tricks. Now it's charging and the blue light changed to red. Also in the app say the Apollo's color is charging and it show the location where it's charging as well. What are adventures? Relive the best moment with you and your pet, map your adventure, what you see where you and your pet went together, link automatically record your path and maps, capture moments, capture all the moments to make your pet parenthood so special, share your adventure, location take you to the map, profile take you to all the information about your pet and also here is where you could put the ambient temperature alert, this is really cool that they will alert you if the dog is in a place that is too hot. Activity goal. This is what we basically respond in the beginning, all the questions. And like we changed the age and the weight. Now it recommends us 90 minutes. In the beginning it said 75. 
have multiple pets so I could manage different pets. Here is the bonus information that they put so now I will have to edit everything like I did with Apollo. I'm not going to show you all of that because that's very repetitive. For Venus, recommended 72 minutes but I want her to be more active so I'm actually going to change the activity goal to 90 just like Apollo. When the device is charged 50% it changed to yellow the light and green when it is fully charged 100%. They have been using them in their harnesses with the velcro attachment. <laughs> you can see it's full of hair already. Uh, but I want to change them and put them in the colors like that they have them on all the time because we do take out the harness as soon as we get home. So I'm going to do them now. This is the attachment for the color. It's the one that have the elastic loop. I think it should fit. So let's see. Let's try the other side. So you pull this tab up to be able to take them out from the different attachments. Well, for sure he's testing the waterproofness of the color. The link color, they claim that they are waterproof. So of course we have to test it. Venus, she believes she's a mermaid, so this is one of the tests that she's gonna be the happiest to do. We're right now here in the bay, trying to test it out with salt water. As well, we will be testing it this weekend in the pool here. We are in Marathon in the Florida Keys. Let's test it. So right now you can see she's in the water and you can see the color is working. We took Venus and Apollo to Crane Hammock here in Marathon and Key. This is a pet friendly museum and it also have a trail system. It was Sunday so sadly it was closed, we just could use the outside part. But I wanted to test the adventure part and record all the walk that we did. Venus, come on.
I wanna test the link on a really small dog like Shrek. He weighs six and a half pounds, and for reference, he used clothes extra small, and his neck size is eight and a half inches. As you can see, for extra small dogs, is way too big. It's almost as the same size of Shrek's neck. We have been using the Link GPS tracking device for almost a month now, so we have a lot of thoughts, we have seen what we like, what we don't like, what are the pros and the cons. So I'm going to be giving you today my final thoughts on the Link. One of the things that we really like is how accurate it is. Is way more accurate than other devices that we have used like the Fit Dollar and the Apple tracking um, air tags. The accuracy is very spot on. We have checked it in different places, different environments during hikes and being in the city at home and it's spot on. I also like how fast it notified me when they're going away. Like, the fit color it takes sometimes up to three minutes and send me a test that the dog is away versus this one in a few seconds from the moment that i'm far away from them i get the notification that's a huge plus for me and i love it one of the cons that i hate the most and i need to buy something else to test it out so that will be in a follow-up video is the battery life the battery life on this is not great. I have to charge it every three days and other devices that I have used in the past, they last way longer than that. The Fee, for example, we charge it like once a month and the Apple AirTags, those you don't have to charge them like in a year, you don't have to change the battery. Uh, this one, we have to charge it every three days I talked to somebody in Link and they told me that it could be because we don't have something they call the plug, I believe is the name, I will put it here. And if we have that at home and we make the home like a safe zone, the battery will last longer. So I want to test that in the future, uh, but we don't have it right now. So as of right now, they, I'm only using it with my cell phone. The battery life is not great every three days i have to charge them if you want it for a dog the size of venus or apollo the size is great the size is very small it's a little thicker but it's a good size for big dogs but if you have a dog very very small like shrek okay, it's a jerky this is way too big for shrek on shrek he was like pretty much dragging his neck and it looked ridiculous on him so I will recommend that if you have dogs that are medium to extra large, I will not recommend it for small or extra small breeds. That's a no-no for me. After testing it on Shrek for only like five minutes, I was like, this is not for extra small breeds for sure. I love that it's waterproof. As you guys know, and you have been watching us for a while, Venus, she's a mermaid, she loves swimming, she loves the beach, she loves the pool, she loves to be in water. And we love that it's waterproof. We tested it in the pool, we tested it in the ocean, and it worked perfectly. And I could, I was able to track her in the moment while she was in the ocean. Also, I love the feature of the light that you have. It's pretty bright, we have used it at night, and it lights pretty well though it drains the battery so have in mind if you're using the feature of the light you will have to charge it probably that night if the walk is something longer than 10 minutes another great feature that i absolutely love is that it notifies me when the dog is in a high temperature environment or a very low uh, temperature environment i think that's great especially if you are not home and you're scared that the house is getting too warm for your dog and you don't know. I love the one you reach 95. For us, we put it at 95 Fahrenheit. It will send us a notification that the dog is in a too hot environment. Uh, we never keep the house that hot. We always have our house freezing 
most people call our house the North Pole but I like having that peace of mind that if I'm gone and by any chance the AC stop working I will get a notification before my dog get a heat stroke something that I think is really neat is that you could customize them by adding these wraps that they have here I haven't tried them yet but when I put the order for the plug I will also put an order for one of the wraps to test them GPS tracking device. The only thing I hate and I hate it a lot is how easy the battery drains. I wish the battery life lasts longer. So hopefully in a future device that they make they have a better battery life. Uh, I need to buy the plug to test it out to see if that will improve the battery life. But overall it's a great product. The app is easy to use. The tracking mode is really easy to use as well and is very accurate. I love how fast it notifies me that the dog is away or they are nearby. Something that I think is really neat about the link is the way they design it to add uh, a multiple attachments. Like that you could use it with different colors, different harnesses, you could add it to their outfits or you could add it. We have used it with the harness using the one with velcro and we have used it with the color using the one with the elastic wrap the only one that we haven't used is the clip on so i should probably use it uh, but we have used the other two and i really like how easy it is to interchange them and use them different depending on what they're wearing well that was it for today's video thank you for watching see you in the next one bye Thank you for coming back to watch the vlog. Oh, yeah. Back. <laughs> <laughs> yep. So that was our review on this link uh, dog tracker thing. It does a lot of things. <laughs> you can see where they're at. GPS. Uh, it tells you their steps. That is true. And oh, and you can even record activities. Adventures, they call it adventures. They're the same. <laughs> <laughs> so that's it, that's what we think about it. Thank you for watching, bye. <laughs>